Yo everyone, Storm Explosion here. Today we're going to be going over the Crimson and why you should give it a try. Um, the crazy thing about Crimson is it's based on Red Death and Destiny 1. So if you get headshots, um, you not only get your clip refilled, but you get all your health back. Um, this is something that's just like absurdly good in Crucible. It may not have like the fastest time to kill and all that good stuff, but it has a decent amount of range and um, you're able to chain kills pretty well while staying in the fight and team shoot with your teammates. I definitely recommend trying it out. I would say try to get the catalyst if you can because it gives it a lot more stability and range. So it makes it easier to um, kill people from a little far away and also kind of keep your shots where they need to be so you can get those crispy headshots. Yeah, so I haven't actually used Crimson since probably Forsaken. But I was pleasantly surprised on how good it was when I picked it back up. Um, I primarily used it with a shotgun, but I'm pretty sure you can use it with a sniper, or sidearm, or whatever other secondary you'd like to use. Um, it just complements really well with either like weakening them and then swapping to the other weapon to finish them off, or vice versa. And I don't have any footage, but I actually used it in the dungeon the other day in PvE. And it was like so much easier to stay alive with Crimson. It's just like, oh, just kill a Thrall real quick and you're good. Kill a drag and you're good. And you get your ammo back so you can just keep killing the adds over and over and over. Um, but obviously, you know, I like PvP a little bit more. So that's why most of my footage is from PvP. Um, but yeah, uh, let me know what you think about the Crimson. Um, I think it's definitely um, just as good as it used to be, if not a little bit better. Um, but yeah, have fun with it. You'll have a good weekend. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye. <laughs>